Hey guys, another quick update on the German DAX just before Frankfurt closing. And most of you know this chart already if you have watched my previous ones. It's a one hour time frame. We still have that falling bullish with a wave wedge here, um, uh, which expires around noon on Thursday German time. And when you have a closer look on that lower trend line, um, you see what happened today. We turned around, but then it DAX found resistance here um, on that lower trend line for about three hours. Um, there might be breakthrough after hours, so um, we just need to be a bit more patient if that happens. And we talked about that range yesterday and um, DAX broke through overnight and came down about halfway. He couldn't really pick up our 100% target of that range, so we might consider this as a false breakout to the downside. So it's like a bearish trap which could dissolve into a crazy uprun rally. Um, and we could pick up these target lines and even that 100% um, range target to the upside. Um, at least we picked up our 38.2 retracement at 39.74. And um, I was mentioning that um, so-called three drive or triple six egg um, yesterday. So we have like three down move, which are almost the same, um, but we missed that out here at 13.745 as well. So when we hop in a 30 minute time frame, I was twittering that earlier. Um, I said that red and uh, the green is like the, the green zone is like the extension of the red. Um, that uh, might be a, a bull bear, a battlefield today and once we get above there above that green zone um it was an hourly candle um most likely we see a strike on that upper trend line here and then um what happens is that um we get a so-called descending broadering wedge which is usually a consolidation pattern in a rally to the upside and um most of the times when we hit that upper trend line, there's a pullback. Maybe we go through there a little bit and come back and then they like to um, pop to the upside. And when we just, um, give me a sec, we just measure that um, high from that low and um, put it up here, wherever that breakout might be at, that gives you an orientation where DAX could run to. So that would be the 100% target of that formation if it becomes activated. And um, that will be around 14, 730. And um, the statistical target is like 83%. So that will be around that 14, 600 area. Um, so just have these lows we have here and uh, keep an eye on that. As long as DAX stays a buff there. Um, as I said, there's a good chance that we jump all the way up here. And um, yeah, that's about DAX. Um, probably make another one tomorrow. Wish you all the best and have a great evening. Thanks, guys.